What's up? Welcome back. You're watching Rock to Alive right here on YTF4 TV. Now, shout out to my best friend. Like, I mean, who needs better? My best friend is always watching. Shout out to you, Maria. And she has a request for you, DJ Jones. Yeah, go ahead, Maria. And it's my, um, yeah, she's saying, um, <laughs> she said that I didn't see it, so she's like, I'm sending in case you didn't see it. Yeah. <laughs> Let me do down away from the sun. Oh, yeah, cool. Yeah. Hi, thank you so much for watching, Maria. She's always tuned in. Thank you so much. Now, let me just send out a few shout outs before we can go to our guests. And I have Sharon K. Tani. She's always tuned in as well. Damn, Metallica is one of my favorites. Yes, you know. I know, everybody loves Metallica. If you don't love Metallica, I mean, like, what are you doing with your life? Alafana <laughs> Sema, the show is fire. As always, play for me. Um, they don't want, uh, okay, they don't want what you want by asking Alexandria. Cool. All right. And then, uh, Iman Jones, hey, shout out to you from County 001. Salimia guest DJ. Salimika. What? Yeah. And there was a sign I love to replay that song, Napenda, again. At his school's Bada College South Men's Conference. <laughs> 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 Oh, <laughs> <laughs> I know, right? But no, he's going to be coming back. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, in a quadra, Mombasa tuned in as always to know Penda Sana from Mojam Pakata, Mazer Hadita Mati, Kwapa, yeah, at 7 30. Don't go nowhere. Teacher Ras, Anasema Eldama Ravine, a shout out to us, Otto Eldama Ravine. Thank you so much for watching. Raskata, Anasema watching from Nairobi CBD. The playlist is late. Design number playlist, Tako in a weather. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you so much. Elliot Mishu, he always has the coolest teas, yeah? He never talks. No. Oh, look at that. He always sends me photos of his t-shirts. Always. Oh, yeah. Always, always, always. Thank you so much for being here, Elliot Mishu. I have G. Kirimi. Anasema, your only fan from Taraka, Nithi County. <laughs> Request, uh, he's requesting going under by Evanescence. Oh. Yeah, I love that as well. Thank you for requesting that. G. Karimi, our only fan from the... Is that true? What's our Tara, Kal Tara Kalnithi? Hey, Tara, is it Tara, Tara Kalnithi? Yeah, what's our Tara Kalnithi? You come tell us. Kujuji is Tete, is he the only loyal one? I'm come out, go, go, here, you come represent yourself. I told you, keep representing your hood. Let me know where you tuned in from. Alafu, we're going to be playing your request. I have many more of you guys, but we're going to be doing that when we come back. Right about now, yes? I told you. Do you have anything else to say? you have some shout-outs before to Nekwa interview? No, I'll do it after the interview. After the interview. Yeah. And then where do you play? For the guys um, who are just like... Uh, yeah, for the guys who want to mm -hmm. find me, yeah. I play all over the country. Because mm -hmm. right now, next week, I'm playing in Eldoret. Yeah. On a Wednesday. And mm -hmm. uh, yeah, um, this Thursday, this coming Thursday, I'll be at Mercury Lounge at ABC. Yeah, ABC, ABC Plaza. Place, yeah. yeah, ABC Place. So, yeah, so do this. Follow him. Or DJ Max. Max with a double X, yeah? It's my, yeah, and then Max, Max Jones. DJ Max Jones yes. on every social media platform. Salafuta Joniwapi and Acheza right about now. Yo, ladies, are you ready? Yeah, we need some drums right here. You know, drum rolls. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I present to you. Well, uh, <laughs> 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 I was waiting for you guys to just do that, you know? <laughs> Yo, Niaze, Mukwaze. What's the name? 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 Hey, come out. Come out. Hey, come out. Come out. Come out. Enjoy, okay. Yo, guys, okay, so, like we've told you, we have Rush in studio. I don't know. I, I, I wish you guys would just, like, introduce yourself. I think it will, it will have, like, some cooler way of coming out. Vile to me, I don't to give you Rush. I'm sure if you did it, you I'm a DJ inside here, but it's hard We've already done that. So next time, I, I had pictured something different in my mind. Like, I'm going to say this and say that. And then you come here and it all disappears. So, but let's go to the studios. Thank yeah. you, thank you, thank you, thank you, Sana. Right. Mm. Mm -hmm. So, uh, <laughs> this is your first time here. No. Apart from Sam. Sam has been here before. Yeah. yeah. Thank you for having me. Yeah. Sam has been here. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, they refuse to come. I don't know. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I insisted they come, they refused. No. Yes, he's the only one who showed up. Imagine. We should find I was you. here. I was the one Imagine. holding that camera. The one yeah. right Why there. Why you don't? <laughs> <laughs> no, 
apologies. Uh -huh. We were having a chat that day. Yeah. Yeah, but you did at the news. Yeah, I remember. Legion, Legion Six, and then yeah, we we always did with sound check. I was here. <laughs> you know the thing, you know the thing Okay, just let's come uh, back. I love will argue later. <laughs> <laughs> Hi. 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 So just kindly introduce yourself one by one. I'm gonna start. Nenzi wapi? Nenzi wapi? So I got Kosho. So my name is Yeah, guys, we are Rush. Um, Sam or Gakosh. Yeah, and what you do for the band? Yeah, I'm yeah. the drummer. Yeah, so it's all drums. Munaski ago, we work on music. Yeah, all right. That's of me. Okay. Mm. And then we have Mark. Okay, so let's meet the Okay, so. Medina. Mm. It seems like I have to clap before I uh, introduce myself. <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> yes, uh, my name is uh, Max, mm -hmm. uh, and I'm the only one guy without lenses. Uh, wow. So yeah, <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Komora is on the on his way. I don't know if he'll make it on time. But anyways, uh, yeah. So I'm mm -hmm. the lead guitarist, and uh, yeah, I've been here since the beginning with this band, having yeah. a good time with them. So. All right, and then go over to Sam. Uh, yeah, as you said, Sam, mm -hmm. uh, lead vocalist. Lead vocalist. Yes. All right. Mm -hmm. we have. <laughs> okay, so my name is Colbert, and I play bass, <laughs> bass guitar. Mm. But I, I really love basses. Bass, you know, when the bass comes on, you can't ignore. Like you, you always get the attention of everybody when the bass plays. You know, yeah, I like that. So welcome. Now that we are all caught up. Yeah, welcome to our studios. First of all, so I'm going to start with the uh, cliche questions. We have to ask that for the people who don't know you. So I'm going to start from the beginning. Tell us about Rush. How it came about. Like, uh, when? When, how, by who? Like, just... What about Baba? Baba. Hey, they, yeah. make me, they make me sound like, like the, the eldest guy. <laughs> okay, so uh, what I can say about Rush, it's that... Uh, we started back in 2013. Yeah, 2013. Yeah. Um, basically, uh, I really ever really wanted to get, to have like a, a rock band mm -hmm. uh, with our former rhythm guitarist. Abini. Right. Um, so we started this project with him, and then my brother came in on board uh, as the bassist. Then uh, Abedi suggested a drummer. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, in the shape of this guy, yeah. and then uh, a, a singer in the shape of this humble guy, Aww. right here, uh, mm. who's actually like his vocals are on point, pretty, pretty on point, yeah, pretty on point. Yeah. yeah. Uh, no, it's okay, it's okay. No, you have to be fair to what's fair. And then after that, uh, yeah, we we've been having a bit of uh, you know. Going forward and backwards with uh, with a few of our bandmates, uh, and eventually we got this uh, this really nice of a guy, and uh, <laughs> also a that very skillful bassist and yeah. guitarist. He's mm -hmm. also a really good guitarist as well, right. uh, Colbert. Yeah. So yeah, um, that's how Rash came about. Awesome. And Komora, like Komora Komora is not here. But yeah. yeah, shout out to Komora. He's uh, to the youngest. Okay, not like in terms of age, but uh, the, yeah, the, the newest, the newest that. member. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So speaking of um, uh, who Komora, is he the one who took Yubu's place? And where is Yubu? Uh, shout out <laughs> to Yubu first of all. Yeah. Well, uh, something came up and yet to go to Memphis. Mm -hmm. So we were like. Life must go on at the yeah. end of the day, so yeah. And then Komora came in. Yeah. Dog. And what about the name? Who came up with the name Rush? And what does that? What does it mean apart from the Rush we know? It's uh, it's um, okay. The answer is basically at the point in which we started jamming with the the former rhythm guitarist, mm. uh, Abedi, our our former rhythm guitarist, saw me that basically I had a Rush 
here. Whoa. From the, from a Nairobi Yes, flight. here is Nairobi fly, yes. I think, yeah. That's number one factor. Number two is that we were like, ah, our music sounds, uh, you know, you can't, when you hear one of our, our, our tunes, like you can't get rid of it. Basically, it was like, like a rash, yeah. basically. Yeah, yeah. Like you can't <laughs> ignore it. We get, so we, we even, even though you might not really like it that much, it's still yeah. there. Yeah, yeah. 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 So no, who doesn't like rush, though? Like, everybody loves rush. So, yeah, everybody loves Rush. If you guys don't know about them, we're going to be playing some of their songs so that you get to, you get acquainted, yeah? But now, um, Rush, amazing people coming, some have left, and you're still stuck with your style. Tell us about that. Okay, even how would you describe yourselves? What's your style of music? Yes, it's rock. And then, um, what, what, what style of rock? I think when we were starting out, we mm -hmm. wanted to be different. Yeah. You know, we wanted to bring something that is that we we will be identified with, mm. because we didn't want to sound like just any other rock band. You know? Right. So we decided to like bring something that people had tried before, mm -hmm. but it hadn't been uh, rubber stamped. You know. Mm -hmm. So the aspect of singing with Swahili, not mm -hmm. so many. Okay, some bands before had done some songs in Swahili, kina Mafis flow, kina PLG, but. I think after we came in and like we rubber stamped that, yeah. we, like everyone knows Rush as the Swahili rock band, yeah. you know? So I think that's something that has really uh, been putting us out there is the Swahili rock band. And right. you know, when someone hears about a Swahili rock band, they would want to hear how this band sounds and how they mm -hmm. sing in Swahili. Right. And I think that has been uh, like the defining factor right. for us. Okay. Yeah. So we, we know some bands would like about... Um, they'll write about politics and some relationships. What do you take us through the writing process? Sam, are the writer or who writes? Who writes for the band, Kwanza? <laughs> uh, writing is a collaborative, oh. collaborative Every, process. <laughs> yeah, everybody puts in a little bit of something. Yeah, okay. exactly. Yeah. Yeah. So Max come up with a, he comes up with a melody or a riff. Uh, then we all just throw ideas, yeah. just throw them out, and see how it, then we just develop the song around our melody or riff, yeah. Yeah. Or even sometimes, I mean, Max can come with a song, like I wrote this song and mm -hmm. you go through it, yeah. So it's, everybody here is just a key uh, so person like in the writing um, the song. Let's talk about Nietzsche Change. Mm -hmm. That's pretty political. Yeah. You guys were not afraid to talk about that. Yeah. Why? Unazua, that's some, what, the one thing people, unazua, like when you're talking about politics, you know, people are like really, really scared of talking about that. Why did you decide to make a song about that and just uh, go out with it? And it actually, you got nominated for Freema because of Nita yes. Change. Yeah, yeah. yeah it, it, it won you guys a nomination. I it got you a nomination. I think if, you, if you've lived in this country, yeah. you know the dynamics of politics in this country. Mm -hmm. So it figured a point whereby, like, I'm speaking on behalf of the youth. Right. Shifi Kamal unasikia umechoka na maisha, umechoka na nchi. Wajinga sisi. Unasikia kia ni unataka ushinde green cards juu wende wapi uko. I think it was at that point whereby you even decide I will never vote. But then we sat down and we were like, if we don't take charge, no one else will. Then these people will always control the narrative. Yeah. If you decide you're not going to vote, then they will make sure the one who they want is voted in. Right. You know. So we were like this song, whether we want to we, we want to encourage people to like mm -hmm. not give up, you know? Yeah. Like Think Nitam Katena. Yeah. Like I will I will do it. Yeah, whatever yeah. happens, at, I've played my part, you know. Right. Is this yeah. something you think you uh, do? Like in future you you wanna write more songs? I think it's about like about politics, the way you did about nature change, like about just uh, the political scene, the way it is right now. Is this something you see yourself are uh, continuously talking about? I think it, that's something that needs to be done. Yeah. Because at the end of the day, it's 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 something it's it's a I don't know how to put it, but uh, it's something that you cannot throw away and yeah. decide that let's just live life as if nothing is. Mm -hmm. It's not. It's, it's affecting us, you know. Right. So many things are affecting the youth, and mm -hmm. I think rock music from way before has been a vocal mm -hmm. genre, you know. Like yeah. if you listen to bands, even if you listen to death metal and 
you like Google the lyrics, the stuff they talk about in the music is actually very powerful. Yeah. It's only rock music that you'll find talking about depression. It's mm -hmm. rock music that you'll find talking about uh, politics and stuff. Yeah. So I think moving forward, depending on how things go, Mm -hmm. I cannot say that this is the last song we're going to do about politics. Yeah. If anything, yeah. all our songs are very educative and they exactly. have a message about it. Exactly, exactly. And we're going to be playing it for you guys. Colbert, what's up, John? Yeah, it's finally moment to share. Because I called, but because I didn't know what I was going to share in Colbert. Hey, your mom is walk. Yay, hey, hey. But is it his real name, though? God, before to Kusifu, is it your real name? <laughs> can you guys confirm? You can confirm. That's it. Oh, oh, nice. I'm okay. not a passport, yeah. Uh, wow. Hey, hey, wow. <laughs> I'm going to ID. So, it's just a man who I'm talking about, but it's too sour. All right, so who, who would you say are some of your influencers? Like, uh, before you even got to the band, who, who do you, would you say uh, Rush is heavily influenced by? In the music industry, that is, maybe in the rock scene. Well, um, if you look locally, mm -hmm. um, a lot of people came before us. Yeah. Um, and some of them are still in the game. And they cross a lot of the mini rock genres. Mm -hmm. You have um, Murphy's Floor. Yeah. You have LYT. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, shout out to LYT, yeah? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes, I've been there for long and they've taken us through a lot. Yeah. And funny story, um, before I was in Rush, I was actually in a band called Void of Belonging. <laughs> Yeah. 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 All right. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Right. Since he was in another band when he was joining you guys, did you make him audition? I mean, you're just like, ah, we, we already know you, I so mean, where could that? He came for the first practice session, <laughs> and we already knew the results. Yeah. Oh. We were like, oh. uh -huh, so maybe you can, can <laughs> let's see if, if you can play this. So maybe who, we knew. So who we asked knew. who to stay? Was he like, can I stay with you guys? Or were you guys like, oh. Actually, it's, it's more of him wanting to stay. Ah, it's more of him <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. And he did. Yeah. Uh -huh. So apart from the Kenyan rock scene, who else? Internationally? Wow. That is a big net. Yeah. That is a big really net. I'm yeah. and narrow it down as much as possible. Yes. Mm -hmm. Um I think I might even speak for Yeah, we play favorites. Mm. So that's okay. We play favorites. So you can pick a band or, um, or two, yeah. Very much Led Zeppelin. Ah. Very okay. Very much, very much. Um, ACDC. I see. Okay. Yeah. Queen, Classic, Bon Jovi, yeah. Metallica, <laughs> yeah. Guns N' Roses. At I will leave it there. No, no, no. He said he's going to narrow it I down. <laughs> now he's just like naming I will leave it at number six. I will leave it at number six. I will leave it at number six. But so I don't over, overload people with information out there. Yeah, mm. exactly. So I know you guys are involved with a lot of other stuff, but you also are in a band. You know, most bands come together, laugh after a while, but you guys have been together since 2013, if I'm not wrong, and you're still here. So how are you guys doing this? Because some of you, I know you're very busy, you're also involved in another band, which is practice, rush also, you have other events, so you also need to practice, you have your day-to-day -day activities. How do you even do it all? Uh, balance, yeah. balance too. Mm -hmm. uh, what can I say? Balancing. Balance, finding yeah. a balance. And how just do you stay work together? It, work around each other's schedules. Mm -hmm. Just when are you free? And you compromise. Yeah, and yeah exactly. Yeah, you it's have to compromise. You have to compromise and yeah. sacrifice time and yeah. Mm -hmm. Just to add on what you're saying. Sometimes we need to, you also have to be tough on yourself and each other. Exactly. Because you can't just say, you know, because we are tight, because mm -hmm. we are pals, you know, mm -hmm. uh, you can't come through, it's okay. Yeah. Sometimes you have to go on your own comes first. Say, yeah, yeah. We haven't met for X weeks, or we mm. haven't met for X days, yeah. or we need to do this by this deadline. Wait, so whose job is that? Who, who does that? Who's the mom of the group? Oh. By a long shot. For by a long shot. Oh, we know. Okay, now that okay, so you are the mom of the group. Who takes longer to prepare? Oh, uh, I don't, uh, yeah. you are stupid. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> <laughs> no, let's say, let's say, like, um, let's say, no, wait, you have a gig to get to. I love it, like, oh, we're meeting in five or ten. 
who will show up after an hour? You are truly. <laughs> you are truly. <laughs> really? Unless you set up. Anyways, I mean, we always find a justification. Oh, we are the instrumentalists. We can uh, maybe <laughs> sound check first, mm -hmm. uh, and then when you get here, mm -hmm. we'll just yeah. check the rest. And the girls, nani who fanya msumbuliwa na madam sasa? Max, what do you have to say for yourself? Yeah. 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 All right. <laughs> and by the way, guys, I, I, do I you don't know? know how to speak Swahili that much. <laughs> <laughs> so maybe you might have to repeat the question. Wow. <laughs> I love girls. You know, like, okay, but the ladies at home, do you know he's really actually into Max Miliano? Do you know how to say Max Miliano? Max Miliano. Is yes. it Max Miliano? Yeah. I love to say Max Miliano. So anyone call that. And then he's right here. Ladies, yeah? When it rush, every social media, R A S H. Go look for him. So in box, I quick you are flooded. R A S H. It depends. Okay, for Instagram, mm -hmm. it's the only exception. It's R A S H underscore, underscore band. band five. Yeah, yeah. yeah. but then. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, <laughs> okay, we're, we're gonna get to that. We're gonna get to that. We're gonna get to that. Band five all together. All right, yeah. so five because you're five of you. Yeah, all right, so, so um, but the the rock scene in Kenya is growing, which I'm very excited about. We even have a rock show on TV. Yeah, very amazing. So, who do you guys want to work with in the Kenyan scene? Like, uh, we've already worked with Raf. Mm -hmm. The song that I changed. Yeah. Raf was the former lead singer for Parking Lot Grass. Yeah. And Seismic. And Seismic. Yeah, he's been here before. Raf has been here before. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So we are open to working with people, looking forward to working what, with What are you looking for? Um, before maybe work maybe even working with my namesake right oh, here. Oh, man. Mm -hmm. Joe. Hey, Max Jones. Hey, 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 hey. hey. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I, 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 I see this. I see what's going on. Junini names. You know, I'll never find it. I never meet my namesake, ever. I never meet anyone you're called Philin. Philin, how? Never. What, what? And then guys always call me Philine, yeah. Felix, Phil. Um, okay, so cool. Now, <laughs> moving on. Now, the is like really pretty fresh, yeah? What, what, do you want, what do you want to do as Rush? What are your plans for 2020, Mbao Mbao? What are <laughs> plans to use Mbao Mbao in Ghana? We are working on our second album. Yeah. So you can go on iTunes, ah, see iTunes, Deezer. Mm -hmm. Even iTunes. Even iTunes. Even iTunes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, sour. These are platforms, are online platforms. And out of your first album, listen to it. Yeah. Purchase it. Yeah, send you to Ongeza Kitambi Kidogo. <laughs> and then we are we are working on our second album mm -hmm. we also have another project with uh, other kenyan rock bands mm -hmm. we are doing like uh, we are compiling an ep oh like, i would love to see that yeah like every band will chuck a song mm -hmm. that is specifically for that ep and mm -hmm. then we'll build we'll have events to build up to a certain festival that we'll have maybe oh. sometime in july uko katikati ya mwaka in Africa too, a few months, it's and then good. I'll call you guys just it's to confirm. Good. Good. Mm -hmm. we, we'll look for you, we'll come here, we'll promote yes, that Yes, you come event. here and launch it. So there's yeah. so much happening, there's right. so much happening. And uh -huh. watch out for Rock and the mm -hmm. 254 for this year. Yeah, this is going to be... In Mbao, in Mwakaya Rock. In Mwakaya Rock. Yeah, yeah. Now, I'm going to say, I'm going to say, he's been talking about that in Mwakaya Rock. He's been saying that for the longest time, ever since he got to the studio. Yeah. Yeah, he was the first... Yeah, by the way, timekeepers, Sam... What are you doing? Sam takes the longest. He got here first. Yeah, no. Thank you. And I can tell I can give <laughs> you a very you. good reason why. Thank you. <laughs> okay, tell me, tell me because why. Because I picked him up. <laughs> otherwise, <laughs> otherwise, thank you for me. Nana penda camera. If it, if it was a rehearsal, we we would see maybe. All right, but what's the coolest thing about being a rocker and um, actually just doing rock music? What do you love most about that? Who's gonna? Okay, Gakosh who mongea sana. who's gonna take this? Gak, not Gakosh, Colbert. Yes. <sighs> yeah, it's, what's the coolest thing about being a rocker and actually being a bassist and just doing your thing? Yeah. I'm sorry, it's been in like four bands, so mm -hmm. you can answer yeah. this question very Tell well. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to get superficial on this. The coolest thing about being a uh, musician, stroke rockstar, is 
mm-hmm. the travel, uh-huh. free food, oh. publicity. These are that. <laughs> travel, free food, publicity. Oh, mm. so, he means girls. So, in other words, girls, and uh, we're not complaining. That's okay. <laughs> Max, what do you like most about that? I think everybody should speak for themselves on this one. Sam, what do you like most about like just doing what you do, just being you, doing rock music and just like being on the platform? Uh, being away from, okay, me seem to a eight to five. I'm not, I'm not an eight to fiver. Yeah, like. so me neither. Just, so just I doing get music what is yeah. basically just doing music is just yeah. uh, it, it's fulfilling. Yeah, and uh, and it's not like a job. Mm-hmm. So yeah. See, you won't wake up in the morning like, ugh. And I have to go to work. Uh, yeah. Like, it's, and it's a 24 hour process. Mm-hmm. You can't stop doing it. Right. Yeah. Max, do you, get, do you ever get stereotyped? Like, because you're in a rock band, and then guys will be like, oh, rockers are these, they're evil. Or when you're just home, like, listening to your favorite band, or just like playing your music, they're like, oh, it's because I'm going or something. Does that ever happen to you guys? Uh, ever? Maybe, maybe not through playing our music, but mm-hmm. uh, through saying that that you know you you have a rock band or a Swahili rock band or whatnot, then they I mean people usually associate it with like some sort of satanic like yeah, uh, yeah exactly uh, <laughs> music genre and uh, but then immediately once they get to know you they they know that um, your personality like it's pretty much as average as yeah everyone else is, just you like know, everybody else like you're, just, your you're, just uh, music. you're just another human being who's uh, <laughs> trying to pursue his dreams and stuff yeah uh yeah so and then to to add on top of uh, what sam was saying uh, i mean rock honestly I, I don't think anyone in the kenyan rock scene and everyone should consider this and no one in the kenyan rock scene really does it yeah for for money or anything they do it for passion Passion. Passion yeah, is the key exactly. word. It's a key P. They, I mean, <laughs> yeah. they, they say it's passion, practice, and patience. Practice yeah. and patience comes with learning an instrument or learning how to do your specific job. Yeah, yeah. that's fine. But passion, passion, passion I think it's, uh, it's very specific to rock. Right. Yeah. I don't know anything <laughs> else, but... Uh, it really applies to rock. <laughs> right, Gakosh, when is your match coming out? And where can people purchase your match if you already have it? And if you don't have it, why don't you have? <laughs> All those questions. Well, yes. <laughs> so, so, let me say, um, if you want any merchandise from Rush, yeah. you can hit us up on our social media platforms. Mm-hmm. On Instagram at Rush underscore band 5. Mm-hmm. Whether you want a t-shirt, whether you want a, is it a cap or a cape? Cup. <laughs> okay, it depends <laughs> if you're an English tomato. teacher. It's a tomato, tomato. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so, just you can order from us and then mm-hmm. we can be able to make whatever it is that you're ordering from us. Ah. Oh. Yeah, that way it's easier because uh, we, we are So, you can customize for yeah, anyone? Yeah, we can customize for right. yeah, depending okay. on what you want. Cool. Do yeah. you have any questions for them? Oh, oh yeah. Um, when is the next video coming out? Yeah. Yes, thank you. You have to be that specific. This year, yeah. possibly. <laughs> <laughs> Most oh. likely. Okay. You just promised us an album. And now we will date. post you. Okay. We will not tell you which date. Which month then? Tell us the month. If we knew, we would tell you. But <laughs> <laughs> no, no, I'm kidding. But, uh, <laughs> but yeah, definitely. Before the half of, half, half the year passes. Oh, yeah, it's so something that we have in yeah. before June. We'll have a video out, yeah. All right, so cool. So, you have any last remarks? Any shout outs? to Kona Talk to my salamu? What to work? Am I what would you tell an upcoming um, anyone who wants to like be in a band or someone who wants to play guitar or just what would you tell them or just be an artist, be in, in, in a band or just play a musician? Someone who's at home never got started, doesn't even know how to go about it. What would you tell them? <laughs> well, a of things, but um, <coughs> first and foremost, um, being an artist or being whatever it is you want to be mm-hmm. is always a combination of factors. Yeah. You know, someone will come and tell you, work hard and you'll get to where you do. Mm-hmm. Um, not necessarily. Yeah. There are people who will work harder than you and will be less successful than you. 
Yeah. There are people who have better talent than you, but less successful than you. Yeah, exactly. So it's all about finding your niche. Mm -hmm. So when I say finding your niche, it's okay, fine. Um, I'm good at guitar. But it needs to go beyond that. You need yeah. to go beyond your talent because, um, like, she plays drums, he plays guitar, he can sing, I can play bass. And that's not enough. Yeah, you need you to go, need to go and say, okay, how do we get our talents out there? So you have to stop thinking about just my craft and start thinking about how can I make my craft available to the people out there. Oh. So focus on that. All right. So, so, so your social media handles, I love for your pass over. Niela was still complaint. So maybe your personal, your personal social media. That is if you want. I love you. He said he like, he's doing it for the guys. I love you. 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 I love Chapter 2 at pronounced underscore Roy. R O I. Oh, R O I. At pronounced uh, underscore R O I. Oh, nice. Pronounced Roy. Max. At Max underscore the guitarist. That's uh, for Instagram. Everywhere else. Okay, like let's say Facebook is Maximiliano G E P E. That's it. Uh, yeah, that's it. Yo, I almost forgot the most important part of this interview. What? How can you? You didn't even. This guy just won a word. Bonam the letter word. So apparently uh, there, yo. <laughs> yo, what? Yo. Yo, what did you go in a zunguka? Sasa unadua ni moja. Kutoa. Kila mtu anaishi kuwaki. Sasa iko tua. Sasa tulia sasa imefika kwa umse. Naza, yeye naza kujana na yo. Yo, guys, I'm not even talking about ati an award in Kenya. No, they won an international award. Yeah. Afrima. Yeah. That is very big. And you've been nominated each and every year. For the last how many years? No, the, the last two years. Oh, the last uh, two only years. two years on a row. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, you've been nominated and finally in twenty nineteen you bagged the award. How did that feel? Yay. Well actually it uh -huh. was it was uh, very uh, surreal. Did that want to invite you to work even harder? Or yeah, to release yeah, more yeah, music? Sure it, mm -hmm. it does because you know, if you get such an award it actually mm -hmm. it, it, it like gives you that vindication that whatever you're doing. Yeah. It's, it's going to greater heights. Bringing yeah. rewards and awards. Yeah. <laughs> and which but category yeah. was that? You were nominated for uh, the best band? Uh, the best, best, band? best African rock. Oh, the best Shoot. African rock. <laughs> yeah. And Nita Change was also nominated? Nita yeah. Change was yeah. nominated in 2018. Oh. Yeah, but we didn't win. Oh, but now you won for the best yeah, yeah. African yeah, rock. Yeah, with the song uh, Grave Robbers. Yeah, your latest song. We love it. So we're going to be playing it right after this. I'm super excited about that. And you know, they showed the video at night. Why? Why would you shoot a video at night? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, that thing yeah. was like a reward because yeah. I remember they had planned that to shoot the video. We actually went to Naivasha. Na mm -hmm. Yeah. Side. Yeah, at you night. shot in Naivasha. Yeah, you see, Naivasha is pretty 10 cool. Yeah, mm -hmm. to around 4 a.m. By the lake. By, By the leg. Yeah. You're not afraid of hippos. We were, but you know, you have to, <laughs> to like. You know, yeah. Yeah, that's pretty cool. It was cool. a good experience. It was actually worth it. Yeah, so before we play the song, just tell us about that. Grave Robbers, that is your latest uh, uh, single. What, what was it all about? Well, uh, Grave Robbers is actually, it's metaphoric. Mm -hmm. If you listen to the lyrics, mm -hmm. actually, if you go to the video on YouTube, we have like posted the lyrics in the description. Yeah. So it's 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 a song about uh, how the it, it's a song about corruption. Yeah. And how the politicians have become so greedy. Yeah. You know, you're robbing people to the grave. Oh. You know, that's actually. That's to, grave to just, robbers. Uh, yeah. To just yeah. sum it up. It's that's super cool. Yeah. I can't wait for you guys to release new music and come back launch it. Hopefully next time you're gonna play for us live. Yeah. Just yeah. come with your you set up and play live. We're going yeah. to be looking forward to that. Hopefully. Thank you so much for coming. You're so cool. Thank yeah. You. And the hashtag, you have any last thing? Do you have anything you want to say before we go? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Mm. Uh, hopefully next week mm. we'll be playing at Jay's. Yes. And we're, okay. You guys are going there tonight, yeah? 20 yeah, more days sure. are playing. We have to support 20 more days. Yeah. Yeah. So hopefully next week, keep it on our social media platforms. We mm. will update you. All right. Not, we'll be playing there. So ladies, there you have it. Uh, our set, Takwaona, next week, Jays. And even tonight, what a papali with TJs. So come through, if you want to meet Max, Sam, Gakosh, Colbert right here. Yeah? 
you have you spoiled for four of them. If you want darker wine, if you want lighter wine. Okay, I'm going to say hapo. Ni refu ni ni ni. I know I'm very make it. Ni ni make it. So, the hashtag is rock to it if I fuck keep talking to us at Philin Jean at DJ Max Jones with a double X, yes. And of course, at Wait to Fight for channel, we're going to be right back with our band profile, but first, grab robbers guys.